Welcome to day 30 of Team Long Runs Getting Started Running video series. Today, I just want to recognize that there are a lot of devices out there, training devices that can help you keep track of your running. Um, you've got watches that cover distance and time and pace. Um, if you carry your phone when you're running, um, it'll tell you your time and distance and pace. Those are all useful, but don't become a slave to your devices. Um, don't look at them and, and judge yourself based on the numbers you're getting on your device. Use them, you know, that's fine, but don't be a slave to your watch, don't be a slave to your phone. Today's warm-up or strength exercise are going to be what are commonly referred to as a Superman. You're going to lie on your stomach on the ground, and simultaneously you're going to lift your hands up and your feet up so that you're going to be in this shape with your belly down. Okay, you're going to be sort of a shallow C, Okay, stretching your hands and chest off the ground and your legs off the ground as far as you can manage it. Um, get into your best position and then come back down. Best position and back down. I would do 10 of those at the most. This is your first time doing them. Um, it's a great core and back stretch um, as well as a strengthener. Today's workout is an old friend. It's my <laughs> probably my favorite. It's the Easy B. Um, it's not as slow as you can run, but it's comfortable. So um, get out between 22 and 25 minutes um, comfortably. Again, a talking, your breathing should enable talking, okay, but it's not your slowest jog. Um, go out and have fun. Today's day 30. Hang in there. Consistency is your friend. You don't want to detrain.